Hello everybody, this is Queen Static here, and welcome back to the Sims 100 Baby Challenge. Our girlie's just waking up. She's not feeling too great. Because as you remember, in the last episode, she got pregnant with uh, the, the first baby uh, by Xander Clovel. I had to look up his name. Um, so yeah. She doesn't know she's pregnant, but we do. Of course, she's going back to sleep again. Like, that's that's what I want. It's really what I want from you right now. Because that's a smart thing to do. I have my good keyboard today, so hopefully it'll be easier to get around like this, you know. I keep forgetting that she's a neat sim, so it's going to keep giving me the, uh, the things that say, like, make bad and stuff like that. Promise you that. Oh no, I canceled that. I didn't mean to do that. Oh well, whatever. Same difference. <laughs> so I moved her into this house in the last episode, as you guys can remember, and I explained to you guys the whole situation of not being able to show you guys the create a sim. Um, I will, I will revamp like all the children. So when you guys actually get a chance to see them, you know, it'll be good. Now keep in mind that I do have some bad custom content in here, so. The babies might be stretched out across the screen. So it might actually take a little while for me to figure out where the babies are and be able to um, fix them the proper way. <laughs> I have to go in and uninstall it, I just keep forgetting. Okay, come on. Wake up. Thank you. Alright. So now I guess I'll make you something. Wow, it's really dark. Alright, uh, have breakfast. You can make waffles. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Alright, I'll promise you that. And that way you get some points for that. Yay! I don't remember putting her in the sea. It's been a while since I've done the create sim, so I don't even remember what her outfits are, to be honest with you guys. Ebony's a natural cook. Yay! She'll probably still set the house on fire, because that's the track record of all the sims. Like every single one of the Sims games. Sorry if you guys hear some rustling. I got some uh, candy I'm snacking on. And I have my hot chocolate too. So. Come on. Oh my god, you're so slow. Now I can speed through this interaction. And the summer festival's here. Of course she wants to clean the dishes. Um. So this is like, to me this is the most redundant part of the whole thing. Or of this whole challenge is to just, you know, try to survive. And it's bad because I cheat whenever I play The Sims. Let's be real about that. I use money cheats, I use all that kinds of stuff. So you made the waffles. I make I made you make the waffles so that you could eat them, Ebony. Come on. You're gonna eat waffles. You have a baby growing inside of you. You can't starve yourself. That's bad. If you're hungry you need to eat. I got the sassy hands going on right now, but you guys can't see that because you know. Webcam messes up. That's that's great. All right, and she's gonna go potty. She's gotta go potty because otherwise she's gonna wet herself. Man, she just needs to be pregnant already. I talked through that whole part of where she was sleeping, so um, there might be some of it cut out. So you guys might just be wondering why I'm crazy. So don't wonder why I'm crazy, because we're all good. Nice. I love the big blocks. It's great. What else does she need? Oh, well, she needs to take a shower. Or, well, okay, we don't have a shower. We have a bathtub. Works the same way. Did you clog the toilet? Oh my god. What am I gonna do with you? 
Oh, I forgot neat sims have to wash their hands too. You know, that's one of my biggest pet peeves is when people leave the bathroom without washing their hands. Like, come on. Really? It takes like five minutes extra. Whatever you have to do in those five minutes, you can do without spreading germs to everyone around you. Oh my god, my fingers are doing their cold thing right now. This might be a actually really short 100 baby episode, I don't know, because my hands are super cold right now. What I mean by super cold is it, I mean that my Raynaud's phenomenon is starting to work in this room right now. It is cold in this room, so. Alright. So yeah, th these are the rooms. You know, we have a bed in here. It's not very much lighting in here, but that's alright. We'll work with it. Of course, she's gonna read. Okay, you can shut up, phone. Um, okay, maybe she's not gonna read. I do like her everyday outfit, though. That's one thing that I do like, is that. What is she doing? If it would work, come on. It's lagging right now, so, oh. Just, we probably have bills. Of course we have bills, because, you know, why wouldn't we have bills? And that probably says visit graveyard during full moon. Nope. You can't do that. I'm sorry. Unless it's a full moon and you're not pregnant and you need to get knocked up again. That's the only way that you're visiting the graveyard on a full moon. But you can't get pregnant, because on a full moon you naturally, uh transform into a werewolf. Which is, that's going to be the other hard thing with this founder is because she's a uh, she's a werewolf. So if she gets into a really, really bad mood or something like that and she's not pregnant, she's going to transform. And that's a bad thing. We can't do that. Alright. So, so far we're doing really good, you know. We have, uh, we have pretty much like everything set. She's not hungry. Doesn't have to the bathroom. She's not really that tired. I mean her fun isn't going down. Sorry, I'm probably like getting you guys dizzy right now. Um Her social's alright. It'll be easier once she has some kids to uh be able to raise her social up a little bit better. Cause right now she has no one to talk to. So, alright, let's speed through this. Well, I think she's learning a skill. I don't know what she's reading. Oh, preparation for pro professional sports. Can't talk. Can't say professional. Can't say preparation and professional together. Oh my gosh. So I'm thinking about posting another Minecraft episode, too. You know, let me know. Let me know how much you guys like our mine my Minecraft episodes. Um, if you guys like this episode too, you know, you guys need to leave a like down below so I know that I should make lots more. These are going to be like the really, really like slow, like redundant episodes. The first few ones where we introduce our founder, where she goes out on the town. Like right now, things are not exciting at all. This is like ho horrible right now. Excuse me. Like absolutely horrible right now. This is so redundant. And we have this at maximum speed right now. It's great. It's wonderful. So I'm probably going to record a longer episode and cut half of this stuff out so you guys won't hear half of what I'm saying anyway. Okay. Still nothing interesting going on. No, we're not going to buy you that. That's going to cause more of a mess than anything else. That will too. So she's going to have to go to bed shortly anyway because she's starting to get a little bit tired. Let's make her some food first though. When it unfreezes. There we go. Oh. What was that? I didn't do that. Uh oh guys. I think it's here. I think it's here. I think we're going to find out right now.
Come on. She's spazzing out like she's going to do it. Yes! Guys! We officially know now. Well, she wants to have a boy. I don't care what you have. I don't know why I canceled that out. I'm bad. Ebony Wolf just found out she is pregnant. She can't wait to make many more memories with the new family she is starting. Alright. So you're going to have dinner. You're going to have mac and cheese. Yes! Guys! We found out she's pregnant in this episode. We already knew that, but you know. Hey, doesn't hurt. No, you can't have a rocking chair. Oh my golly. I'm, apparently I'm a very popular person today. It's all my Twitter followers. You know, I'm popular on Twitter. Actually, not really, but we'll pretend that I am. <laughs> wow. This is, like, definitely more of a boring episode than the first episode. Even the first episode was way more exciting than this. Oh, golly. She just... What, we've cooked twice in this episode. We've watched her sleep. Yeah, this is just... Insane. That's a big pot of mac and cheese for one person there, Ebony. Really big piece of mac... Piece... Pot of mac and cheese. Can't talk. Can't talk at all. Ever. It's bad. Alright. I guess you can do that. Why don't you eat? You never eat. You always make your food, but you never eat it. Now she's finally eating it. I have a lot of the sound effects turned off, so a lot of what people are used to hearing, they won't hear. Um, like, you know, the when they play the guitar and stuff like that, even if you shut the music off, you can still hear music on the guitar and the piano, and that's the main reason why I shut it off. And it is pouring rain outside. I have all the expansion packs in here. Um, it won't let me reinstall Dragon Valley for some reason. Don't know why. There was a while that I couldn't get this even to work after EA took back over again. It's like, really? Come on, EA. Worst, by the way, guys, this is one of the worst customer service experiences that I've ever had is with dealing with them. The other one I might make a vlog about and just rant about it. And that that's going to be longer than five minutes because I need to rant about that. She wants to read a baby book, but we can't leave. So I can't leave to buy her baby book. Alright, well, she does need to go to the bathroom. Alright, potty, use. Oh, wrong way. Her bedroom's this way. And sleep. Okay, so she does have a double bed, so I guess that if we don't move out right away, I guess that uh, we could put some of the kids in the room with her. Although she does need the double bed for other things. So, yeah. I guess I'll be back when, you know, she's done using the bathroom and freaking out. What's she freaking out over? The toilet again, of course. So I'll be back when she's done uh, doing what she's got to do and sleeping. So I'll see you guys in a little while. All I'm saying is that you better not be making, like, apple or watermelon pancakes. Apple. Apple pancakes. Yes, because she can't eat them. Because that helps determine the gender of the baby. And we can't do it anything that helps determine the gender of the baby. It has to be completely random. Also, that's something else that I didn't like about The Sims 4. The way that they made, um the random chances. They said that they didn't change the, ch the random chances, but when I first started playing The Sims 4, my Sims would have babies and it'd be like, they'd have three sons and no daughters, or three or four sons and no daughters. Or, you know, three or four daughters but no sons. And it was just, it's ridiculous. 
I was like, there has to be something that they did different in here. It seems like it's changed a little bit now. I haven't played Sims 4 in a, like a month or two, but partly because I want to play it with you guys again. Because I can actually put my face on The Sims 4. <laughs> I can put my face cam up. It's great. Wow, this is going super slow. Come on. But yeah, anyway, I'm sorry for the audio in the last episode. It, um... It wasn't intentional. I did not realize that it was going to be that bad. So I, um... I didn't have a way of doing it. Because the audio recording that I made separate from that didn't really sound too great either, so... Come on, hurry up and clean. You gotta clean. Well, no, you're not going to China. You can't go to China. She's got some mean heels on right now. Oh my god, come on, just cook. I'm starting to get frustrated with you, just cook. Come on, not that difficult. Wow. Yeah, I'm going to record this episode for like a half an hour, and I'll be wondering what I'm doing with my life, because absolutely nothing is going to happen in this episode. This is going to be like the most boring episode ever. Everyone's just going to be like, Why'd you record this, Kristen? What'd you do? This is boring and lame and stupid. Well, I'm, rec I'm going to record for so long today, because I'm going to cut a lot of this out, so that makes it a more interesting episode. Yay, waffles. I want waffles. That was the one thing that I miss about Fredonia, was that one of the dining halls had waffles. And they were like huge waffles, and they tasted so good. Oh my god, I want some again. So I'm hoping that uh, when I get my new car, if I go to visit, I'm hoping that I can go and get waffles for breakfast. I'm going to tell my friends, I'm going to be like, bring me to go get waffles at Cranston! Although Cranston usually makes me sick, but not that one, it doesn't. Not the waffles. You can't have a job. Stop wanting a job. You can get your uh you can get your skill points up, but see I can't think of the words of anything today. It's almost like I'm nervous, but I don't have very much stage fright anymore, so I don't know what's going on right now. She's starting to do the waddle. Starting to do the pregnancy waddle. Yay. Yeah, the social will be a lot easier to take care of once um, once she starts having kids because she can talk to the kids to get her social up. She doesn't necessarily have to talk to, you know, a guy or talk to a friend or something. She can talk to the kids instead, which is wonderful and nice. So, no, you can't have a spa day either. I'm sorry. Sorry. Well, you've already prepared prepared waffles. Alright, so she's going to have to use the bathroom again. It's so funny, because it's, like, delayed by a couple seconds. So I can see it out of the corner of my eye on the recording screen, and it's like, I can move the camera like that, and it takes a second sometimes to process that I move the camera. But it already has on my game. I'm like, that's weird. Really weird. You guys are probably going to get annoyed with my incessant rambling in these videos. But then, I'm rambling because I have to remind myself that my face isn't up there, so you guys can't see my reactions. Because if I turn on my video camera, it'll make my game freeze. And not only will it make my game freeze, it'll make my video recording software freeze. Not only will it make those freeze, it'll crash my computer. So, yeah. I don't think I'm doing that. What are you freaking out about? Where are you? You're at the sink. Why are you freaking out? Uh, clean until pristine, please. Because you're not going to use a dirty toilet. No, you're not. Because clean sims don't use dirty things. So I figured that if this baby is a boy, I'm going to name it Jim. But I'm going to spell it G-Y-M instead of J-I-M. Partly because of uh, where the baby was conceived. We'll see. We'll see where it goes. Wow. You need to get your social up. Can you, like, call and chat with anybody? 
call Sim. Chat. Uh, we'll talk to Nikia O'Malley. See if that helps get your social up a little bit. Your social's starting to go down. I heard Nick Alto acted quite rudely to Vita Alto. Nick and life, yeah. Perfect. The dish showdown. Sorry. Can't enter the dish showdown. Like, I don't really care about these people. Like, they can do whatever they want to do. They're human. You just don't act rude to me. Uh, come on. Is it getting your social up? Yes, it did. Oh my gosh. Wow. That was really good. That was a good idea on my part. All right. I don't think she has any fruits or anything in her inventory. No, so we can't start gardening. Let's see. Does she have anything in here? Um, open. No, she does not. Okay. So I know we're supposed to go out to meet guys, but we might have to, uh, get some uh, fruits and vegetables and stuff so that she can pl start planting them because I don't want to use the buy debug or um, testing treats because I want to try to do this the right way so but if she has that income from doing the garden then that should be fine I mean she could also probably I don't know I don't know I don't know what I'm talking about it's been a while since I played this game without cheats. It can be really hard sometimes because it's like you constantly have to spend money and you're not getting any money in if you don't have a job. It's like, yeah, oh my god, I want to, uh, just want to try to, um, make my sim successful. Like, then, you know, your sim has a kid and nothing happens and, oh my god, it's bad. What are you doing? Are you reading again? Why? Why do you constantly read? I guess that's a good thing. You know, I like to read, but I guess it, it's also a bad thing, because, like, why are you reading so much? Wow. Legitimately, she's still reading. Okay. Come on. Let's check on her self. Alrighty. Um, what can you... Oh, don't serve lunch. Have lunch. Um, we're gonna get get you to eat grilled cheese. Um, I also like... I liked The Sims 2, the university one for The Sims 2, better than I did the university one for The Sims 3. Um, I'm not exactly sure why I like it more but I do um, but there's a lot of aspects of The Sims 3 that made this my favorite ones of The Sims games and I think that it was mainly the Supernatural and the Seasons expansion packs now many of you guys are saying well Kristen you know The Sims 2 had Supernatural and Seasons in a different form and yes it did but oh nice you're gonna burn it <laughs> she burnt the grilled cheese sandwich I think but uh no, I I definitely like the fact that in The Sims 3, you know, there was better graphics and you had more options of Supernaturals in The Sims 2. And also for seasons in The Sims 3, it seemed more realistic than it did in 2. So I think I just said Supernatural was my favorite was season 2, or was the second one. No, um, Supernatural was 3. The, this one. This is one that I like. Because you get to have werewolves and fairies and you can have zombies and everything. And she can't even transform because she's pregnant. But there's a full moon, guys! That means that the zombies are gonna come out. Did you just... Did you really just put that in the refrigerator? I'm gonna punch you. Not really. I'm not that mean. But like, really? And it's freezing up again. Don't worry, she's just going in the fridge. There we go. Come on, let's eat. I don't have all day here. Mm. That grilled cheese sandwich good? 
Ah, oh, she answered me. You hear that? She said, mm-hmm. All right. Uh, I don't want to enras the toilet. Sorry. Okay, so as soon as she's done here and she goes to use... And, uh, she goes to go to bed. I think I'm gonna end it here. I don't know how much of this you guys will see. Or if you guys will see any of it. Or if episode 3 will just be episode 2. Um. So, I'm gonna leave it here. Um. I hope to see you guys all in the next episode of The Sims 300, baby. And, um. Remember to share, smile. I don't know why I keep saying and um. <laughs> but remember to share, smile, and I'll see you guys all in the next all the next time. Bye-bye.